from pool A55, and Shen qualified from pool A65. Okay. In pool A59, it's Snake Eyes versus Blockbuster John in winner's finals. <laughs> That's in a pool, Wednesday night fights match there. <laughs> yeah, they played a lot. In pool A54, it's Alyun versus Zachary United States in winner's finals. Nice. And in pool A56, Kambu River, Captain Ginyu, and Kyo in winner's final four? I don't know what that means. <laughs> I'm not sure how to decode that message. Maybe it's the top four in winner's finals or in the winner's bracket or something. I, I don't know. know. Maybe somebody's name is Captain Ginyu and Kyo. I'm going to look <laughs> it up. You never know. Yep. But we have now, we mentioned Ilya from San Diego, a very, very strong Akuma player from San Diego. Mm -hmm. Going up against Gutex, most of you out there who have, you know, who have been watching fighting games are very much aware of Gutex and his uh, excellent adventures. This is pool A52. And is this uh, winners maybe, losers? Huh? We'll find out. Winners, winners bracket. Side. Yep. Okay, good stuff. So these two guys still in winners. So let me see if that means that we're in finals. Not sure. Okay. Just wanted to answer a question here. Basically, yeah, we, yeah, we are. By the way, this okay. is winners finals. So someone asked me to explain what the difference between delayed wake up and the and regular wake up. Basically, it's just 11 frames of difference. So if on a hard knockdown, it's the only time you can do a delayed wake up is on a hard knockdown. And the definition of a hard knockdown is that you can't do a quick rise. <laughs> so if you can't do a quick rise, your options become delayed wake up now. Basically, after a sweep, you can make it so that you get up at the normal time or very slightly later. Yeah. That's uh -huh. all. Sweep or throws or getting hit by yep. ultras and such. such yep. so. And some special moves. Yep. So Ilya against Gutex. Gutex has decided to go with Rose, character he's you know, been playing a lot for a couple of years now. Mm -hmm. Been uh, probably his main. He used to play Balrog. He was playing some other characters, but I think he's right to stick with Rose. Yep. Saw him play Yun for a while, Sim for a while. I thought those were not his characters. So yeah. I, I, I think Rose is a really good pick for him. And Ilya, like we said, a very strong Akuma player. A good start for Gutex so far. He's already drained Ilya down half life. But Akuma can be a very strong momentum character. And just like this, he's getting a little bit of a start. And immediately gets the life caught right back up. Pressure still, wow. I like the idea. Gutex. Got a chance again from the front. No, from behind. Nice block. Gutex hasn't stopped blocking or getting hit so far. He might still be in danger of getting dizzy. Okay, he should be okay now. Yeah. Gotta watch for EX. Oh, I think that might have been. Well, it was Ultra 2. Oh, just trying to eat up the. And boards. he did. Yeah. Oh, she got right over that. Oh, oh here we go. Chance. Oh, he just did nothing. Huge chance. Did, and yeah. you can see it on Ryan's face right now. He's blowing on his hands, trying to heat them up a little bit. More offensive start now for Gutex than in the previous round. Might be trying to switch things up on Ilya. Doesn't want Ilya to get a read on him. Very patient play, though, by Ilya. He knows that he can play for the knockdown, as you saw in the previous one. Okay, now let's see what he gets. Delayed wake up, so it's not quite as good. That media pressure. Oh, wow. Just made it right over there. Caught him with the demon flip. And an empty jump. It's going to suck him right back into the corner. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, he Had missed. to yeah. spend so much meter to make himself safe. But it was the right choice. Oh, no. Tried to reflect the fireball. Didn't work. Both times his Ultra 2 has gone wasted. That's a big loss for that character. Good block here, tried to chase down. And I think Gutex would be happy to take some, yeah, take some meter, take some ultra meter with those fireballs. Yes, that's okay. what I was talking about. Gotta watch for EX through. Wow, and a wake up there it is again. from Ilya. All right, look at this. See how much meter she builds when reflecting. Oh! Oh, oh no. just mistimed the reflect. Just mistimed it. Killer. I mean, obviously, it's a little more awkward trying to catch the air fireballs as opposed to the ground fireballs, but still, that's got to be painful to, 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 to lose a, such a close round in that fashion. Yeah. See him trying to gather himself. And he sounds like he's gone to character select. I wonder if this is just to 
settle himself down or if he's going to switch characters. Common tactic to take yourself back to the character select screen and, you know, not intending to change any characters, but just use that as kind of a little time to yourself, delay things a little bit, slow down the opponent's momentum. And that's what he did. All right. I mean, Gutex basically barely lost a lot of those rounds there. Yeah. So let's see if he can, you know, just – it's just clutching it out a little bit more. This you know? time a, a more defensive start. Doesn't seem to have worked out. Always interesting to note what players do at the start of the rounds. Those opening gambits are a huge part of any fighting game. Oh, wow, chased him down. Caught him with that. Oh, nice, using that stand medium kick. Goes over low attacks and is not throwable. Uh, Ilya was done taking that. Just got out. Okay, here's the setup. Now, can you get anything out of Ultra 2 this time? Yeah. There's right. the reflect. He was looking for it. And what's going to happen? Oh! Ooh, wow. and then he gets himself crumpled. Yeah, Ryan has a very quizzical look on his face. I agree. That was not an expected reaction from Ilya, but Ilya did it perfectly. Great response. Oh, and Great then he response just goes for Ilya. the frame trap, and Gutex is very angry at Gutex right now. Look for the grab again. He got that before. This time, Gutex stays away from him. Oh! Stand strong, counter poke. I see some reaction faces in the crowd. They did not expect that one. Gutex taking a little bit more of an offensive approach here. He's got the corner for himself. Ilya has played this so interestingly. The, the whole set, very patient play, just looking for one opportunity. Mm -hmm. And it's worked out for him. He, he, oh, yeah. I mean, the best thing about it is he knows he doesn't have to have the life lead or anything like that. He knows that he can win with a good sequence. So he can play very patient and careful and never panic and not feel like he's ever out of the round. Ooh! Didn't quite catch. Oh, oh Ilya can still do this. That'd be a heartbreaker for Gutex. Yeah, like I said, it's just... Got to look for the EX spiral. Gutex hasn't been able to clutch it oh. out, but now it's Ilya's turn to clutch it out. Ooh, oh, my God, that didn't EX. kill him. Oh, and Ilya knew it was coming, but couldn't fully get away from it. Nice by Gutex to close the round. So trying to fight back. There's the grab. Pressure now in the corner. Wow. Huge. Reset. Gutex has to get away. No, he got the stun. And that could be it. And, and it is. is it. Ilya yeah. closes it out. Sends Gutex to lose her side. A very painful way to go out on a perfect like that. You just wa always want to come back and just tr try again. Like, oh, I need that other chance. But In the round right before that, he made that recovery. He ended up closing it. Not so much in that round. Mm. And an interesting style switch by Ilya in the last round there to go from having played so defensively and patiently and then go in, go in. I don't think right. Ryan was looking for it. Yeah, but you know what? Uh